Okay, so we're going to move now from Heidegger's essay, uh, The Question Concerning Technology, to his essay called The Origin of the Work of Art. Uh, remember what I said, The Question Concerning Technology was written after, um, and The Origin of the Work of Art uh, written before, but in a strange sense, the diagnosis of the problem happens in The Question Concerning Technology, uh, and the solution comes in The Origin of the Work of Art. And if you remember what the problem <coughs> Heidegger is responding to here, or diagnosing, uh, is nihilism. What's nihilism? The reduction of the meaning of being to one meaning, right? The, which is tantamount and the same as the concealing of concealment, okay? And Heidegger thinks that the reason and origin of this nihilism, of course it originates in being itself because being conceals itself and being, of course, wants to conceal that it conceals itself. But put that aside for now. The origin of this is actually in thought itself. Remember, technology is Nietzsche, and Nietzsche is Plato, and 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 the and from Plato to Nietzsche, Heidegger thinks is the history of metaphysics, which is the history of Western thought, which is, or the history of reason itself, which is we could say, uh, as some uh, postmodernists have said, logocentric or foul logocentric. In other words, reason itself is the problem here. And Heidegger's asking in the artwork essay, is there a non-instrumental conception of rationality? We want to think of it that way. Or can we get to a kind of thinking, I should say, that allows for uh, the non-instrumental? Can we get to a way of thinking, uh, perhaps a phenomenological way of thinking? And what he's going to say is we can get through it through, we can get to it through art. Uh, a way of thinking that gets beyond utility, that gets beyond reason uh, in the uh, useful sense. Or uh, remember we were thinking about, uh, we were t I was talking about in the last video, when you think of the essence of something. And the, the history of metaphysics from Plato to Nietzsche is a history of the thought about it, the essence of things, the whatness of things, right? What is the what is the being of something is the question of what is the form, what is the essence of it? And for Heidegger, and he's going to show in this essay, form is wrapped up with, essence is wrapped up with, quiddity is wrapped up with utility. Uh, reason is instrumental. The question is, can we get beyond that and still think, okay? And the answer is going to be simply, yes, we can through art. So what Heidegger is going to do in the essay is he's going to use art uh, to phenomenologically disclose a different way of conceiving of being and of, in turn, beings that is non-technological, that is non-utilitarian, that is non-instrumental, okay? So the origin of the work of art is the response to the problem of thought that's characterized the Western uh, metaphysical tradition, which is thought being nothing more than will to power, Nietzschean. And he's going to say that if we think vis-a-vis art, right, out of an artistic comportment rather than a technological comportment of Dasein, we can actually twist free and unravel from metaphysics, unravel from this instrumental view of reason, and open up what Heidegger later calls a new beginning, a different paradigm of thinking that uh, that embraces the sacred, the holy, the, the concealed dimension of existence. And so in this essay, he's looking to art to actually reveal concealment. Okay? Remember, in the history of Western thinking and instrumental reasoning, concealment is concealed. But in artworks, uh, concealment is revealed. The process, that is, the process of being as revealing and concealing is actually revealed. So being, as the illumination of things in their beingness, which uh, shows things in, in, a, in a certain meaning, in a certain interpretation, but also hides other interpretations, that very idea, that being interprets itself and shows itself as an interpretation but hides other interpretations, is itself revealed in the artwork. Okay, I'll say that one more time. What, what the kind of thinking that, that gets underway in the artwork essay is the kind of thinking that reveals being as revealing and concealing or illuminates illumination or illuminates being as illumination which, which also hides, okay? Remember, in the history of thought, it's, it's the metaphysics of presence. Everything is fully available. Concealment, the fact that there are other ways to think about being, about being uh, or other possible ways for a thing to be conceived or other possible ways for a thing to be, that's concealed. Possibilities are concealed with Gestell and in the technological framework in, in metaphysics, in rationality. But in the artwork, what, what comes to the fore is the idea that uh, things are uh, concealed. And so even though they're revealed, they're concealed. This is the interesting idea we're going to take up, uh, or Heidegger's going to take up in the essay.